the mission of the Community Foundation is really to help those that are in need of energy assistance. You know, when we first got started, we are just trying to define what we want to be as an organization and who we want to support and the type of support we want to provide. We were semi-homeless. Like, we didn't have any electricity. Uh, and then my rental lady was like, she don't even know why she was letting us stay there without no electricity, because it was against her company policy. I was, it was devastating. Like, it was to the point that I was, like, crying every other night. You know, my baby was cold. Some nights it'd be cold, I have to put more clothes on her or wrap her up in more blankets. But it was some troubled times. It was very, very bad for me. I was in a pretty bad situation where I was laid off from my job. Um, I'm a single mom of four. My daughter has asthma and I couldn't afford for my electrics to be off. Every day we see many families who come to us for help. Many come from families that have been suffering because of unemployment, not being able to get um, unemployment compensation, or they've lost their jobs. There's also been situations where there has been a divorce, which has made um, the situation where the income that was once there is no longer there. We have families that have come to us with um, immigration issues, health issues, and all of those concerns have affected their ability to maybe uh, pay their bills on time, to pay their bills at all. You know, we do a lot of charitable giving through the company, but there are, it's always, you know, it could be $500, could be $1,000, could be $2,000, could be $10,000, but what we wanted to do through the foundation was make impactful contributions. There are three organizations that benefit directly from the funds that are raised from the Golf and Tennis Classic. It's the Greater Washington Urban League, Mary Center, and Interfaith Works. They have ensured that those customers who are most in need are the individuals that are ultimately recipients of those particular dollars. I'm glad that we have places like the Mary Center, Pepco teaming up together and helping out families like me. It makes me feel that somebody is out here is really trying to touch other people's families other than their family. And that's a blessing. We really needed Washington Urban League. They were fast paced. Everything worked out well for us. Um, I was able to be stabilized and get my bill back down to the amount that I can afford, so it really worked out for me. We've been able to help hundreds of people in need in Montgomery County over the years that we've had this relationship with Pepco, not only through the tournament and the proceeds, but also working as partners in helping to educate uh, people in need and also their customers about utility conservation and um, how to make sure that they maintain good utility service. On behalf of the PHI Community Foundation, I just want to thank everyone that's in the room this evening. Without you, this would not be possible. Without those community partners, we certainly would not be able to, you know, experience the type of success that we do. But I'll tell you, as, as good a job as I think we've done through, that, through, uh, through time, uh, there are so many families out there that continue to have needs. I must say thank you, thank you, thank you to Pepco and all the donors, all the golfers that have come out and have taken their time to participate. Your contribution has not gone unnoticed and believe me, it's valuable and has made a difference. I would like to say thank you so much to the PHI Community Foundation and Washington Urban League. I think it's a great program. I'm thankful for it and I'm sure anybody else who goes through it is thankful for it as well. I just wanted to say thank you. I just, I can do better. I know I will do better. I will be better. And this is a step in my life that I am stepping towards the positive way. And I wanted to know, I just want to thank Pepco, thank the Murray Center, and thank everybody that's been behind everything, behind me and my family. And I'm greatly honored and appreciative. I'm greatly honored.